Now, sometime last year, you will know that Neo showed some robots performing quality tests. I think it was on the Neo main logo, if you remember that video, and also the seat belts. They were making sure that quality gets to be conducted, but those were not Neo's robots. Neo just partnered with another company in China, right, that made those robots, but those robots were performing a very uh, big function onto Neo's factory inside of making sure that quality gets tested. I did say that one of the things that makes me to like robots is that robots don't get tired, right? As long as they still got battery, as long as they still got power, they will work, which this is the future. This is what we like. The reason why I'm taking you back there is because apparently the new CEO just shared more, even more robots that are performing quality checks onto Neo cars. I mean, as soon as you notice that these robots, it appears that they are checking, they are taking pictures, checking the quality of the cars that Neo is currently producing, which this is very important because Neo produces premium EVs and therefore premium EVs should meet that standard. Quality should be top notch, right? And therefore seeing uh, these robots performing this, it is something that is great. Last year, it was the humanoid robots. This year, we see this kind of robots performing quality checks, which is great. This is where the future is going of EV. We are not going to see a lot of people in factories producing cars, but we are going to see an automated factory that obviously works mostly on robots. And Neo's factory, you will know that already. Most work is being done by robots, yes, uh, human beings or us, what we are doing, or those that are working and at Neo, they're just adding other things, but most work is being done by robots, which of course shows you where this is headed. Neo, it is a high-end tech company, and their factory should also be high-end tech, right? And I'm telling you, Neo, the way I know it, they are going to make sure that not only they rise or they continue improving on their cars, but they will also improve their factories so that their factories can produce car faster and do not compromise on the quality that you find or that we get onto those cars, which is something that is very important because some people or some factories, the more if they are to produce fast, then obviously they sometimes they make mistakes, they compromise the quality. But Neo, knowing Neo, I don't think they will compromise quality at all. In fact, they will make sure that the quality does not get to be compromised they still give 100% quality like the, well, how they've been giving it over the years. So yeah, man, this is what we saw. These are the videos that we saw. I mean, have a look at this video, man. I mean, these are some of the videos that we are seeing uh, coming from Neo. This is just great, man. This is good news and it shows you the massive potential that lies within the Neo stock. So yeah, man, I am happy. I am excited. I know share price wise Neo might not be where you want it to, but look, long term will win. We shall be rewarded with time because Neo continues to do something that is not easy for other EV makers to do. Neo, when it comes to technology, they remain up there. Previous video, we we're talking about the comparison of Neo's battery shopping stations against Tesla supercharger. And I won't repeat what I said, but obviously, that video showed us that Neo is ahead of the game. Neo continues to improve and if the fourth generation battery shopping station can be able to complete a battery shop onto Neo uh, cost by 2 minutes and 40 seconds, can you imagine what the fifth and sixth battery shopping stations will have or will be able to do? Because over and above storing more batteries, I think they will improve on the speed, the amount of speed it takes for them to complete a battery swap onto Neo cars, which is great, which is amazing, and it makes me want to load the boat, right? I mean, Neo is a company that it will do very well because of its technology, because of what it can do, because of the massive infrastructure they have. I think in the long run, this company will win. And right now, they've or they have not only produced, uh, they are not only producing Neo Premium and high-end cars but they've got a family brand on for which this is good this is exciting and this 
brand will be able to cater for everyone looking to buy cars for everyone wanting to buy or take it to the next level that is getting cars of top quality cars that comes with massive technology this will be very important this is important and this is why Neo will win this is why Neo will continue to do very well so yeah man i am happy i am excited no share price wise Neo might not be where we wanted to but we shall be rewarded man we need to hang in in there because obviously i know right now share price wise might not i know it might be hurting us where it might not be sitting well with us right now especially where neo is trading at as compared to other ev companies but look our time will come we'll get an opportunity to shine neo will do very well especially when we get to profitability things should start getting better which so many of the investors analysts are waiting for q4 of 2025 when neo is going to hit or reach profitability which is great which is exciting otherwise just thought i'd give you this quick update tell me what you think about this blue sky is coming long term will win those that are persevering throughout the heavens of the share price will most definitely be rewarded with time like this video because it takes me some time man to make these videos and i am trying my best to give you all the latest content latest news that have to do with Neo. So I appreciate when you like this video. Uh, if you have not subscribed, subscribe, hit that notification bell, share it with your friends, family who are loving Neo or who are into Neo because the many we are as a Neo community, the more we'll be able to squeeze out the short sellers, the naysayers from this stock, which will reap us good rewards in the future. I will see you on the next one, man. Hopefully the share price today finish on a green or we see it continuing with the good momentum that we have been seeing uh, recently. A lot of the new investors at least are starting to feel at ease because $5, it was a share price that Neo has been struggling to get to in recent weeks, right? But thank God it has broken the $5. Hopefully it doesn't go back below $5. But let's wait. Let's see how things unfold. I will see you on the next one. And God bless you all.